Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I do unboxings, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, travel, home decor, and even the very occasional dash of Disney. So if you enjoy unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And that way you'll find out whenever I post new videos, which is usually at least once a day, whenever I announce giveaways, which is usually a couple times a month, and whenever I go live, which is usually on the 8th of the month at 5 p.m. Pacific. As always, if you're already subscribed, thanks again so much for being here and welcome back. There are still a couple of days left to sign up to participate in our channel holiday gift exchange. The details and the link to sign up are all over on the community tab. We would love to have you join us. Today, I have one of the few beauty boxes that I open consistently here on the channel and it is The Box by Fashionsta, which I think is a fantastic value and a really great way to be introduced to indie brands. Most of them are are cruelty free and vegan brands which I think is awesome as well this box is $24.99 per month you usually get five to six items with a value of over a hundred dollars consistently sometimes well over a hundred dollars and like I said I just think it is a great box and one that I like to support because I respect their mission and their ethics I will leave a link for you in the description box below that will save you 10% over on their website I'm not sure these days if it applies to the subscription but either way great value again at $24.99. This box was sent to me for a review. It's actually the October box. So as with many companies, they are experiencing some delays with getting their products. So it is kind of understandable, but it did honestly arrive to me very, very early in the month of November. So I'm okay with that. Now inside, we just have their product card. And I also love that they actually do a theme every month, which is not something that every beauty box does. This one is Kindred Kindness. So I kind of love their like black and white photography aesthetic. I feel like she's holding like a light diffuser or something. On the back, it does tell us in these little blocks about the different brands as well as the retail values. It does say the total retail value of this particular box with five items is $137. So more than five times the cost of the box. And there is a little uh, space for them where I'm actually glad that they included this because they do have a cause. They are a give back company. And I kind of forget sometimes to mention it so says your subscription lovingly counts in brightening the lives of others with kindness and compassion and enables our partnership with 1736 Family Crisis Center assisting people recovering from domestic violence and human trafficking. I think that is such a fantastic cause and another thing that you can feel good about in subscribing to this particular box. So let me prop this up in front of me and we will get into the box by Fashion Star. They also do a men's box um, which is kind of cool because you know the guys need some subscriptions uh, love as well so like grooming tools and skincare and stuff so right on top the first thing I see is by Jubal Naturals so this is an intensive repair cream in the scent of pink grapefruit natural vegan and cruelty free so nice kind of big tube of this so let's see what it says about this um, this has a value of $12 ultra rich reparative moisture bursting with the aroma of fresh pink grapefruit I absolutely love citrusy scents so I'm excited use after bathing, showering, or anytime as needed, vegan and cruelty free. Um, my husband, along with uh, picking out all the candles, likes to select all of the lotions that he uses. So he might like this one too, um, but maybe I will hide it and keep it for myself. <laughs> All right, next is State of Kind. That is a great name for a brand. It says Kindly Restore Sleep Concentrate with Rose Hip Seed Oil and Bakuchiol, which, man, I've been seeing that ingredient in so many more um, items. I believe that's like the natural retinol. I think that's what that is. So let's see. I saw that in an item that I think was in Geo Box, which I am so sad they are discontinuing their subscription service, you guys. So um, that is another reason I, I I love the box and I want you to support it so that we can keep these like vegan and cruelty free brands going. So cool bottle. So it's kind of this like matte bottle. So let's see what it says. Um, this has a value of $65. Not that the value necessarily indicates what a good product it is, but I do think, again, you're getting a great deal in this subscription in terms of getting to try out brands you might not put the money up front for otherwise. So it says this multitasking sleep concentrate is formulated to deeply nourish repair and hydrate skin overnight leave skin supple fortified and hydrated it is again 100% natural vegan and cruelty free I am all about that so 
Um, so it does say that it has 200 of milligrams of CBD in it. Interesting. For external use only. Yes, of course. So I will have to give that a try. So it says you can uh, put it on your face and neck, but avoid lips and eyes. So interesting. I haven't been very good about doing like a nighttime skincare routine because usually I'm just like dragging myself to bed after either like staying up too late watching TV or staying up too late looking at my computer screen, unfortunately gotten better about wearing blue light glasses at least so something came in this little bit oh we got some eyelashes wait I'm so <laughs> I was so confused at first I thought it was just one eyelash I was like why did they send me one eyelash so it's this nice little travel case so lashes on one side but then there's some on the other side too very inventive instead of that like classic like rectangular plastic case so I'm wondering if I can get into it okay so that's the side with the hinge I think this is by base blue maybe Maybe. Yes, so it's their Swift Lashes. This has a value of $11. Lightweight, ultra wispy, perfectly rounded set. Ideal for adding an instant dramatic effect and fluttery finish. Medium length. Wow, these for medium, these are really long. Um, and volume for a comfort comfortable wear for any eye shape. They are cruelty free, so they are super duper long. Those are much longer than the um, eyelash extensions that I usually do. So it just is on this hinge so you're not gonna lose them which is nice so I let me know in the comments below one if you wear false eyelashes or if you get extensions or you like the magnetic lashes I have been wearing false eyelashes since I was like in high school because I used to do a lot of performance whether it was hula yes I grew up dancing hula but also just doing theater and stuff and we were always using like was it should you use the clear glue or should you use the like dark glue and I always used the dark glue but um, I think that this is actually kind of cool. Um, the magnetic lashes, I've tried them, but the set that I got, like the, the actual liner was just a little bit like goopy and it actually made my natural lashes all like clumped together. So I did not like that. I thought like magnetic lashes were going to be like the solution to all of my issues and that I wasn't going to have to get eyelash extensions anymore. But, um, I do like to have some like false eyelashes for when I haven't gone to get my extensions for a while, or I do want to be a little bit more dramatic. But like I said, these are considered medium like weight or thickness and length that I think they're like super duper long but I like them and I'm that's like the first time I think we've gotten lashes in the box because I've been with them almost from the beginning so let's see we also got something from quick slick oh my gosh this is I love these things you guys these are like these are the best so this is what it looks like in the box so oh, I'm so excited about this. this is easily my favorite item already so this has a value of twenty two dollars I'm going to try to get into the box neatly so quickly and easily touch up your hair no alcohol safe for sensitive scalps non irritating non flaking essence to slick and smooth your baby hairs and flyaways it has a light peach scent how exciting um, it is cruelty free so I've definitely got gotten this before I've also used like a clear mascara for the same thing but it is definitely better to have something that's meant for it so this is what it looks like it does have some plastic wrap on it so I'm probably not going to um, open it up quite yet it says insert name here that's funny um, so I'm guessing that it works like the other ones that I've had in the past where it kind of has like a mascara wand and you just kind of like put that right over the flyaways I usually do it like at my part or sometimes like this part you know if I've had my hair up gets a little bit frizzy right here and it is such an easy way to like kind of clean everything up or if you already have your hair like sort of slicked back into a ponytail or a bun and you have like me a lot of baby hair or just little like wispies it cleans everything up super duper easy and it's a kind of better for me or it works better for me than necessarily like hairspray or gel it's just like for the little touch-ups and it's a great thing to have in your purse because you might start off the day looking like slick and sleek but then by the end of the day walking around wherever you are you need a little little touch-up to kind of get that like glam gloss going back on so that is easily my favorite item in this box I am so happy because I was in need of a little bit more I think I've been like trying to like scrape a little bit out of the, the bottle I currently have and then finally our last item so yes we had the lashes the quick slick the sleep concentrate and the pink grapefruit lotion this is from copycat cosmetics which is a brand I have not heard about I'm guessing that it is a palette because we almost always get a palette in um, in the box by fashion style and some people complain about it and some people are like well it's not adventurous enough or it's not everyday use enough so you can't make everybody happy but I think it's kind of fun to get palettes because I think it's a fun 
fun thing for me to gift to people who wouldn't normally buy a palette. Sometimes I will occasionally keep them. Um, and usually, like, I will say that I have kept quite a few palettes from the box because I've really liked um, the interesting colors. So, and they always send us, like, smaller ones. I can't, I get overwhelmed by, like, the super giant ones that are, like, a keepsake box that you have to keep forever and ever. So let's open it up and see what we've got inside pretty simple it does have like a teeny tiny little like square mirror here but let me cover that up. oh my gosh these colors are intense this is like i feel like it's like 80s legging colors or something look at that you guys i hope that they're like as highly pigmented as they look because those are fun i don't know that i will use the yellow but i could see these being really awesome to use especially with like a fine tip brush and like a little bit of maybe even water so that you can really like get it in there but i if they are even close to like that deep and true in color those are fun like look at the teal this is a really fun color i love this kind of like indigo purple here i don't know about these colors but i do like to tend to wear a lot of warm colors on my eyes so let's see what it says about this oh so insert name here quick was the name of the brand that creates the quick flick so this is the by crown even though it says copycat cosmetics on it it says this is the shocked palette in uh it is a value of 27 dollars six matte and three shimmers in this beautiful nine shade palette perfect for pops of color and dimension with great pigmentation and blendable perfection it says it is cruelty free so it says crown brush on here but then it does say copycat cosmetics here so i'm a little <laughs> did they copy crown cosmetics i don't know but it does seem to uh describe it correctly because it is the um purple that really pretty blue and the teal those are our shimmers and then the rest of them are all matte so i might hold on to that one just because it is so fun to have some intense color it's not really like a holiday palette i feel like it's a little more like spring or summer when you want to get a little bit more creative and bright but that's kind of neat between the lashes and the eyeshadow palette we definitely have a definite uh, eye look going on and of course you can kind of clean everything up as well with the quick slick and then and hopefully your skin is already feeling very refreshed with the uh, nightly concentrate or the state of kind kindly restore sleep concentrate and then we of course have that rejuvenating pink grapefruit from jubal naturals so you guys let me know in the comments below what your favorite item in this was i actually think this was great even though there were only five items and it came a little bit late in the month i actually think i will use all of them which is kind of rare for me to actually say there's usually a couple of things that i think i might re-gift um but I think the palette is just so fun. I'll hold on to it for a little while. Definitely loving the quick slick already. Haven't even used it yet. Lashes are always a great thing to have on hand. And then lotion and a night serum, also great things to receive in a box. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please help me out by giving it a thumbs up. And I will see you all very, very soon in my next unboxing.